First down, OSU. That's Carter in motion. And the give to Hall, taken down immediately by Mario Williams, the freshman. Off against Georgia Tech, second down and 10. Ball back to throw. Tries to get out of the pocket and is wrestled down by Mario Williams. And yet, it's still strong with his hands. Oh, he dwarfs so he it beats the block. <laughs> he just, and then finishes the job. Yeah. He knew their program, so Chris Woods came over here. Back to throw, and being sacked is Reggie Ball. All about the footwork. So he got beat out of stance. You can't get beaten out of your stance for that program, and rightfully so. Yep. And Reggie Ball is flattened by Mario Williams. Christian Chen, spinning run for Coleman, he is stopped. Second and seven from the Wolfpack 12. Job looks to the end zone. Oh, man. Nearly has it picked off. Very high on this young man's feet. And this is a big play because Lundy's open in the flat again. He's been in from the outset tonight. B.J. Dean injured. Greg Jones trying to get him into the end zone, and he's worked over on second down right at the line of scrimmage. He'll lose a yard. Huge win for the Mountaineers. Third down and long. Zwick empty backfield from the gun. Pressure from behind. Flushed out of the pocket, and he'll go down. Mario Williams tracked him down. Third down and nine for Randall. They dial up the heat. And they cook him back at the 15. Again, Reggie Herring is going to come with the linebacker blitz. Notice the zone blitz. That's a defensive end dropping in the middle of the field right there. Inside handoff and blown up at the point. Four. But there you see, that's just brutal strength inside by McCargo. I mean, he just decided at this point he was going to dominate the line of scrimmage. That's awesome. First and ten. Ball at the 43. Lock the throw. It closes down. Almost intercepted by Mario Williams. First and ten. Wake Forest at their own 20. End around. Here comes Idolette and there's nowhere to go. Mario Williams led the charge. And Matt Wisnowski. Will he be asked to decide this one? Barclay threads his way up the middle. They know they can get the ball back with this unit. They feel like they can win with this unit. See, look at the shoulder square. Hey, it's pitch a punch. And the worst thing you could do is turn it over early. On the snap, out of the shotgun, Mario Williams in pursuit, hit him. Ball is loose on the ground. It's ruled incomplete. But Mario Williams was all over Reggie Ball. Caught off guard. And inside, I mean, nothing special about that free runner. Blitz is on again, again. They pick it up here. Ball the company in red shirts when he gets there for no game. But every university around the country would like to be able to do this. Cut the field in half, and they get this many shirts, guys in red shirts, to get a quarterback who runs four or five. Both have strong arms. Marcus is right-handed. Michael is left-handed. And here's Marcus to the air, and it's batted down at the line of scrimmage. Mario Williams 209 look he completely obliterates the picture of Vic as we look at him that means that Vic's picture downfield six defensive backs in the game for Virginia Tech on third or for NC State rather on third and 13 and Vic to the air and should have been a pick you've got a twist coming over here on this side and they do it on that side because right tackle Dwayne Brown again has only been a right tackle for two weeks let me ask you I'm not watching the game but they've thrown the ball up to 89 Greg Carr yet in the end zone well he's been injured here lit and this is going to be a sack all the way back to the three yard line back in, here in the second quarter now NC State's going to take the time out after a loss of 10 put in his hands and let him do something with the mail he did he got he delivered the first down first down and 10 backside pressure and Hollenbach got rocked by Mario Williams. The stadium jump, he's making scouts jump all over the place. You see Mario Williams coming from the outside, just beat him with speed. At Carter Finley Stadium, this is the 10th play coming up of the drive. Under three minutes to go in the first quarter. Hollenbach sacked by Mario Williams, but his feet never stop. Watch his feet. Even though he's throwing moves, his feet never stop, and he just has great closing speed. And when you have your vision on that quarterback, man, it is like a heat-seeking missile coming for the kill. Bam! Down goes Hollenbach. Second 
second and ten. Nice hit on Merrill's by Mario Williams. And you were to see him beat right there. Nice inside move and the agility to adjust straight down the line. Watch as he recognizes run and that quick little step. Backs line up out of the eye on first and ten from Maryland coming back the other way. Hollenbach sacked back at the nine yard line by Mario Williams. Watch Mario right here. This is why he's the number one pick and probably the best defensive end in the country. It's because of his size. Oh, that Reggie Hump. He hit him with the Reggie Hump. He got him going up one field, took his right arm under the armpit. And then with two turnovers today, it's led to 10 points for North Carolina State. And another sack and a fumble. And another turnover. Mario Presley was there. And the pack has it back. But again, we talked about we need somebody to give him some help. But when you got a 6'6 guy that can throw a swim and have closing speed on his target like that, you need to give your offensive lineman some help. Third down and six. Huge play coming up for Maryland. And it doesn't work out. Up here. And watch the X stunt right here with Mario Williams coming inside. And beating the center. McDonald. Look how he gets low. He turned that shoulder. You have Lawson and Mario coming in to finish. And those guys have been big time players coming into the game. Mark, they've had 32 tackles for loss between them. So we will see how Jerome Springfield is able to handle that solid defensive line for NC State. And Juleman doesn't find anyone open and he's brought down Mario Williams his first sack of the game. Nobody's there it's just second down the linebacker is inside here you just raise up give it to the receiver going vertically down the field. Reminds me a lot of Javon Curse. Yeah, he, he is a freak of his own, in his own room. On the end around, they give it to Amari Jackson. Just staying outside, you see the presence of Mario Williams right there, and then he gets things turned back inside, fights off the block. He has done so much in the college game. He's already NC State's leader in career tackles for losses and sacks. He has done virtually everything asked of him as a collegian and he does it right there on third down you've got to have double teams and right here walter walker has his hands full gives him the outside move and comes right underneath and into the backfield with andre hall but you see that they have forced him to become one dimensional now they've got to throw the football to get back in it jomas has his pass tipped incomplete Will miss under pressure goes down again another sack that's the sixth sack those other two guys uh, Williams and Lawson are in there as well but you see the pressure and look at the guy redirect that's just pure athletic ability right there 